This winter, one of the hottest sturgeon spots has been around the Dunbarton Bridge, and the good bite has been triggered by tremendous amounts of fresh water pouring into the South Bay from nearby creeks, setting up perfect brackish water conditions. I sampled the action with local sturgeon experts Abe and Angelo Kunang aboard Melvin Seal's vessel, The Music Man. We're uh, going to be looking for the marks of the sturgeon on the bottom. This edge right here is our bottom line. We're looking for a fairly large red blob down toward the bottom or a hump on the bottom. While Angela looks for fish, I asked Melvin, what's with the green bead? Is the sturgeon blind or not? Yeah. Is he blind? I don't know. We'll find That's out. That's a good we'll color. It yeah. looks good to me. <laughs> we decided to drop anchor on the edge of the west side of the channel in 30 feet of water, where Ange spied a little bit of activity. Oh, that big mess of bait there. Or could be a fish also in there. We have two different types of sturgeon rigs here. Mine's very simple, 60-pound test wire with rubber coating with a single sharp hook. But Angela has something a little bit different. How's yours work? Okay, this is a tandem hook system, and this one's made out of heavy monofilament. This is a 120 pound test monofilament. It's a small diameter monofilament, and uh, it's easy to make. This rig uses too much shrimp. To hook the mud shrimp par properly, start at the base of the tail of the shrimp, right there, where the fan opens up. Okay. Okay. It goes through the body. The shrimp will kind of curl onto the hook like this, see? You don't want to break through the skin at any point. Once the hook point is right up there, up where the legs and the claws are, you'll feel the point right where my thumb is. Just leave it right there. And see how that shrimp lays? Perfect cast. Now we'll just have to see what the sturgeon think. A short cast only 20 to 30 feet, and make sure your sinker is resting comfortably on the bottom and we're set. Here's what to look for. The inside of a sturgeon's mouth is almost the consistency of leather, so you have to really stick them. But watch for that. When you see that, set the hook and maybe you'll get lucky. And it doesn't take too long before Abe's got something going. Here, there he is. Well, still, there. still there, Abe? Yeah, but it looks like it could be a shark now. Oh, let's take It's the real thing. What you got, what you got Abe? You hung up? I don't know. Feels like a shark. You have a good head check? Yeah, yeah, that's one. I got one. I got one. Good going, Abe. Oh, he's going. But way up here. Sure? Yeah. There, there he is. is. Keeper. Looks fine. Yeah, he's close to keeper. Looks like a real thing. Yeah. Go ahead. Sure. Go ahead. There he is. How's he hooked? Is he hooked good? I don't know. Find out, huh? <laughs> yeah, here he comes. All right. Get going. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah. The minimum size yeah. limit on these fish is 46 inches. This one turned out to be close to 50 inches and about 35 pounds. Okay. As things slow down, Ange demonstrates how sturgeon feed. This is the sound of a sturgeon feeding. They're very loud feeders. And you hear him crunching the shrimp up. <laughs> Even in 60 feet of water. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen for it. It'll help you locate him. Everybody Looks like Mel was paying close attention. Oh, oh, he's on. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! What's he feel like? I just want to come oh, feel too heavy. Uh-oh, what do we got? Shark. Uh, that's a big shark if it's a shark. Oh, I feel a little weight now. That's one, yeah. Come on! Whoa! <laughs> Waking up, Melvin. Oh, yes. Yeah. You realize he's hooked now. Right. I thought he was going to jump there for a second. Oh, that's a nice, yeah. that's bigger than the yellow one, that's for sure. Really Just easy. easy. Oh, oh, oh. oh! Yeah! <laughs> you need help? <laughs> hey, Craig, maybe we should use a snare on this one. <laughs> Yeah. 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 And here's how Melvin catches these big fish. So what's your secret? <laughs> secret? The green ball. The green ball. <laughs> hey, you're going to mess up a lot of people when they see me. Green ball! What's the green ball?